We're honored to have you guys here. It's been a long road to get to this point, and it's it's humbling to be here finally. Feet, go. We're league mates. Feet, grab your feet. This is a scrimmage. Good, Galindo. We expect utmost sportsmanship, which I know we're gonna get. We're gonna play the whistle. That's it. Sit down. Sit down. I want you guys to be kids today. Go. Let's go, Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I want you to be happy. Balls of your feet. Right? I know that's what we're gonna get from the bells. And I know what we're gonna get from the Padres. Alright guys, let's have some fun. Go! Come on, Jay! That's it! Oh, yeah, that pre-period with the linemen was was spectacular. It was so fun. And uh, I got a little emotional just, just watching it and seeing the happiness of competition and the happiness of you know being a kid. And that's been taken from, from these guys for the last 12 months. Just one, one, three, one, two, three, check yeah, It was real exciting. You know, it was really exciting, ready to come out and play. <laughs> Just getting them back out there and getting them jumping around and laughing and having fun and competing and falling on the ground and, and being a kid was what today was all about. You know, everyone's been, been waiting for this moment. Uh, whole team is excited. You know, been working hard this whole off season. One thing about this Sarah team that uh, you can expect this year that's different than last year is we're huge. What impressed me the most was it kind of looked like football. <laughs> you know, it looked like football. We made a ton of mistakes, and uh, but I was happy with the defensive performance. The defense played hard. They rallied. They hit. We have a lot of size up front. We do got size. That don't mean we can't move. You know, run blocking, pass blocking. We're really just moving the ball downfield. Our line probably averages about 6'2", 300, maybe 285 at least. And I, I'm being generous on the height. I'm not even kidding. They're huge. On both sides of the ball, guys just getting their energy out, and that's that's the best anecdote for all of this misery. On defense, we have a bunch of young playmakers like you saw today, like Jabari and JoJo, who are freshmen. Oh, yeah, Jabari and um, JoJo Bay, yeah, they did real good. They played like they were on our, like they weren't even freshmen. They uh, executed good, very well. Go. Unfortunately, we got like 16 guys out because of COVID. Didn't matter though, because we still balled out. And uh, I'm looking forward to hopefully getting those guys back on the field next week and uh, facing Valley. There's, there's no replacing doing something you love. And the only way to do it is to actually do it. And to see that love and enthusiasm and, and just being a kid, man. I just, these kids grew up over a year trapped in their homes and just took a lot of effort to get to this point. So I'm really happy that these kids got to feel that joy today. Waiting a long, long time for this. So all I want you guys to do is have fun and compete. I like to think we're in a unique position as a program because, you know, Coach Walsh kind of being the head of, uh, you know, the Let Us Play Act, Let Him Play. He always reassured us, you know, he's going to get it done. It's a testament to how, how much the coaches care about you. I want to especially thank Coach Walsh for everything he's done for a season, and I think every high school football player in California should thank him because what he did was nothing short of a miracle, and I'm thankful for it every day. He was willing to go fight the state on it, <laughs> and that was crazy. Father Joe Bradley's going to take us away, okay? Father Joe. Take a moment and thank God for the blessing of today. It's headed in the right direction, but there's still massive obstacles. California's still way behind. We're still way behind the other states that are that are doing it with less restrictions, less obstacles. You know, it's still, you know, again, we played without 18 players today. And we're going to follow the rules. We're going to follow the guidelines of, of the county and the state. That's, that's what we're going to do. Um, but it, it's hardly normal, you know, and I'm not going to pretend like it is because it's not. And until we get to that day, there's going to be an obstacle that we either have to go through or jump over or, or deal with. Uh, but, yeah, we're, we're going to continue to fight to, you know, get this state back to what it means to be normal and obviously do it the right way.
uh, you know, I'm hoping to accomplish the, you know, progress and get better and just to win all of the games. Well, the goal is to go, you know, 5-0, and undefeated, win every game, win league, defend our crown, and um, just have fun out there. Have fun with my last, uh, last true year with my boys, last couple months for me and uh, I'm enjoying every second of it. Pies on me, pies on three, one, two, three, pies!